All right, Tough Shed, uh, Minneapolis, St. Paul. Uh, just made the move. Uh, staring out the front door here. I'll uh, walk outside and come back in. See the traffic on the highway here. Uh, pretty busy. A little waterway just across the street there. Not, uh, not frozen yet. Um, right over there is where our sheds will be going. So you can kind of see from the door to where it'll be. I think we get uh, one, two, that first right, this one right here on back. Uh, I know Chuck's got a couple of uh, little display lamp with that uh, done today uh, to, to get it finished. But uh, probably do some small ones, the big ones you won't be able to do right away because uh, we won't be able to uh, to paint them. But um, overall, great traffic. Uh, something really cool. So check it out. We, uh, we got a sign up. Um, obviously, it'd be cool if it's a little bit higher, but I'll take it. Uh, they, uh, know where our door will be obviously the top shed right there so you know pretty much our office is from that wall to right between those two bays so uh walking in now to uh tough shed st paul check out doug's uh doug's office here actually a little bit bigger than i thought um but uh kind of give a, a 360 view here you can hear the guys in the indian dealership um Give it a little round. You can see outside, you know, so Doug's got a pretty good view. It is an insulated door. It's actually still, it stays pretty warm in here. Um, but uh, yeah, we just finished the bulk of all the furniture moved. Got a couple things hung up. Got this rug here, uh, which was worked out pretty well. This is an old oil change facility. So you can see it's actually metal bottom right there where they actually covered it up where they used to go down the basement to make the changes. And there's all kinds of uh, drains and different things. So the carpet did a pretty good job covering most of it up. You can see the furniture there. Tall cabinets, you know, trying to cover up most of the wall. And, um, you know, Doug's obviously desk area here. Um, he did say he's going to try to do most of his deals. He prefers not to do the deals at his desk, but come in a more open area, design area. So he's going to use this section here. Walking on over here. Um, and we, we did our best to really put all the furniture right in front of the wall to cover up. If you can look down there, there's actually an open space. Oh, there's a bunch of boxes. He's got to get that put away, but open space there into the um, Indian dealership. And, uh, you know, got those bars that are, you know, hold up the, the uh, temporary wall. You know, get our permanent wall until we're out of here. But um, the uh, uh, printer, everything's hooked up there. Um, Eric's uh, program getting the. Uh, uh, credit point program today. That'll go right there. The only outlets we actually had, we've got two. One there, which we need to cover on. The other one is back in that corner. So, I actually ran all the electrical um, extension cords just along to here. Got a spot here just down to plug everything in. And another one goes around over to there to get everything plugged in. And for the most part, uh, you know, Doug's got everything finalized. A couple small boxes to put away, but. Um, Got a pretty decent view out there. Um, gonna have to get him something to slide his chair onto this floor. He's uh, not gonna slide real great on this metal grate. Um, so probably make a trip to the Office Depot store here before long. But um, you know, overall, uh, overall a little bit bigger than I thought. <clears throat> this wall over here, I'll send the dimensions to Chuck. Um, he's looking to get a little creative. Not sure exactly what he wants to do, but um, he's gonna look to get some sort of uh, you know kind of small shingle and uh, paint sample, paint wall there. So, all right, that is uh, Tough Shed uh, St. Paul.